be getting buffed afterwards, right? Yeah. That's kind of getting good. Ready? Hey, man, he's got to get ready for SWC. He needs all the help he can get. Yeah, no, right now, we're going to see if Lamogi's going to need any help getting to his mainting tune. He's putting the pressure on right now. Goes for the overhead on the Rekka there. Yeah, he's I'm putting the pressure on early. Doesn't want this little boy to get anything started. I'm curious, how soon are we going to see advancing strife, right? Are we going to see it thrown out in our very first game here? I mean, those plus frames are pretty solid. DP has faded out. Goes for the EX punish. No, doesn't put anything else on it. Oh, the jump was almost perfect, but this little boy in his flash tank. On the back, gets followed the level one. Goodbye, Kyo. Hardly knew ya, but now it's time for Hinako to come on out. Right, this let's... character needs buffs, all right? I want yeah. her to be so good. Listen. You know, not all DLC can still exist. Gato is still paying for his crime. That's true, that's true. Oh, oh but here we go. it begins. Throwing. Never mind. Right, the I like slowest the jump in the game. Oh, you saw he tried to go for the advancing strike right there on wake up, but got stuffed. Remember, it does have a longer startup. The, uh, the armor frames don't come out as fast as shatter strike. Yeah. Nice combo. All right. Set up. Okay. <laughs> Those just don't work against this little boy. There is no setup, all right. But now we're going to put you up against the wall. Chip damage will do it. And you see the ball oh. rolling back on Craig's face. And there we go. Get you with the sumo palms. Yeah, what a what a backdash there to to get yourself out of that situation on wake up. Now Naj, the newly buff Naj coming in. Yeah, I actually kind of like this color a lot. I've never actually seen this color. Woo! Roll forward gets caught. All right, what's the Oki? Oh, never mind. That dad doesn't give her any Oki, but that's an unblockable. <laughs> Oh, oh, again with the palms, hard knockdown. Just tries to go for the hop in, and there's the stomp. Catch you on your toes. Yeah, for, for what it is worth, she does have a lot of interesting close up options to either make herself plus or frame trap, or uh, to even bait you out from trying to do any reversal options. Yeah, for sure. She's just so slow in trying to get in. Yeah, one of the big things too, we didn't really get to see a whole lot of Naj, but Naj getting the ability to uh, cancel uh, far D into special moves is huge that character, right? Yeah, it really is. Here You're now go. playing Look neutral a little bit easier. Such a slow floaty hop, but it's still scary. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Okay, Hinako! Never mind. Okay, Hinako, go die, girl. Yeah, 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 it's okay, it's okay, because Terry, Mr. Terry Bogard is coming on in. Still a solid character in the anchor position, can dish out damage with the best of them, but trying to catch Kukri is going to be the difficult part. We got the standing D, but we didn't believe in it for the quick max. Yeah. There's four bars basically on both sides, but this is one Kukri away from dying. So Let's see, trying to create a little bit of space. I like that hop in to get pressure. Trade is going to be in Baja's favor. Oh no! Oh, you're dead. Oh, no! We missed the confirm. That is tragic. I mean, still not over yet. Has the life lead. Has plenty of meter to close this out with one more touch. Nice. Get off of me. You like that? This is a very strong first match to start off with. Oh! No, slow and steady. Both players so patient too. Standing D again. Not another quick match, but it was a counter hit. The sand pillar snipe. This is literally anyone's game. Oh my god. Bro, well, who's the power guys? I feel like that had to have been a missed input. It's all yeah. right though. There we go. 2C is going to be enough to close out game number one here for Fumogi. Yeah, really good stuff to start out. Really consistent. Strong play from both players right there. And a lot of good movement I saw coming out from both players. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, Fumogi, though, uh, missing uh, some big opportunities there with the standing Ds, right? That was the classic back in vanilla was with Terry, you throw out standing D into quick max, just kill them. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, even on air counter hit, you just do it. Absolutely. Let's see if we'll be able to get those locked in a little bit more going here into game number two, or Baja is going to clap back right away. Mainty Kun pretty much took down Kyo without any trouble in game number one. I'm curious if we can repeat that. It might be time. The the sleepy boy might be awake. Every chance we get, we're gonna dash punch. <laughs> he just keeps doing it. Yeah, there we go. There 
it is. DP hitting behind. Dash punches afterwards for the follow up. Yeah, you gave me space. Time to dash punch. There it is. CT. Yeah. Goes straight into the level one. Not nearly enough to kill. Way too much scaling on that confirm. But man, we are sitting pretty with this health boost. Nice, Rekka. Okay. Uh oh. Fumogi not done yet. All right, now don't get hit by a flash kick. Okay. Oh, instead gets hit by the dash punch. Has to block the meaty fireball, and there comes the sweep. Yeah, that's, that's how the sleepy boy gets out. That's true. That is absolutely true. But we did do a much better job managing him this time, right? So it means that Hinako has less of an uphill battle to climb to close things out and even things up. Speaking of climb, she cannot jump against him. Woohoo! Bro, put you in the corner. Where do you think you are Yo, going? Yo, what a back roll! Slapped. Yo, that back roll was clutch. Yeah, incredible awareness there from Fumogi. Now, let's see if we can put the hands on Naj once again. Okay, what a round start. EX Rekka. Oh, no! Safe palm. Wow, into the advancing strike. Gets the knockdown and gets that bar refunded. That's what I'm talking about, right? It's so strong because if they block it or if they get hit, you're getting that bar back no matter what. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Uh oh, uh oh. That's so Level much two. damage. Shake your head around. Scramble your brain. What the? Oh, you guys is the over there and nice. Able to finally get rid of Nosh once again. Hinako on a tear two games in a row, Cookie. Yeah, I mean, that armor, I wasn't expecting to kick in there, but Fumogi knew that uh, I got to use my buttons where I can. I'm a slow grappler. And there's another one. Yeah, perfect call out. Oh, trying uh -huh. to chase down to go for a command grab. Nice roll there, though, from Baja Zero. Yeah, Baja immediately trying to get out of any pressure. Immediately jumps back or rolls back. Mogi is doing such a good job of just keeping it up. There's the command grab again into the safe jump, able to block the teleport out. And now your back is up against the wall. And here's the confirm for Baja. No, tries to go for a reset and the advancing strike comes through. Get off me. Tries to go for a shout strike this time. <laughs> Bro, what's neutral? The man is it. mastering new movements. <laughs> that was that was amazing. He just cycled both options. He's like, I'm gonna do this till I have no meter. One of these will hit. Now coming through with Mr. Bogard again with the standing D at round star. Tries to chase down with the track shoot to close the distance. I love how slow Fumogi is willing to play, right? Not yeah. really taking any huge risks, just waiting for one opening to find that strike. Oh. And nearly would have had it there if we had the quick max. Yeah, just got to up those hit confirms a little bit, but Fumogi really in the driver's seat right now. You don't want to keep getting jumped on like this. Oh, boy. Guard break potential. Oh, and just... the advancing strike does do a lot of guard damage, too, as well, so you need to be careful about that. Uh, EX Fireball oh. jumps straight over. Still not enough. There's the guard break with an EX Fireball again. Power Wave takes it. Yeah. Good job, Fumogi. Terry, no slouch when it comes to guard bar damage. And EX Power Wave definitely helps with that, having multiple hits on block. Yes. You just have top tier on top tier in this team. It's really, really good. Yeah, both of them pretty scary. Of course, Isla being incredibly versatile. One of, if not the best character in the game at the moment, but still going up against number two, which yeah, is Keith, and he's not too far behind. <laughs> and then you got the character that can just run through everyone, regardless of tier and oh yeah. Right, able to get the hit. How is Advancing Strike different from Blowback? That's a good question. So Advancing Strike, you only get a combo if it hits a throw. That's the only way you get a crumple into a combo. It armor lasts longer, starts up slower, and it's plus on block. So those are the big major differences. Yeah, it is uh, what we call KOF 15 Drive Impact. Yeah, uh, but Drive Impact if it refunded your drive. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
So far, we've only seen a little bit of it. Yes, same amount of meter. Only costs 50 bar, and if they block it, you get your 50 bar back. I can see. Oh, boy. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Going in. All right. Tries. Oh, we don't go for the taco option there. Probably could have hit on that whip 2C. Yeah, now you might die for that. One. This doesn't kill you. The mix-up certainly will. Yes. Okay. I don't. I. 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 I think Robert thought that wasn't real because the JA hit so early that he that he tried to press and still got hit regardless. Uh -huh. <laughs> there we go. Oh, nice 2C. Get you with the big boot. Oh, no. The classic wake up 2C match from Oyash. Yep, yeah, into the mix up game once again. I see a question asking why would you even use Shatter Strike, right? With Advancing Strike being a thing. Shatter Strike is mostly defensive uh, because if you hit someone with it, you're going to get a combo no matter what. Oh, also, there's uh, a parry. They also change the scaling. Yeah, that's right. The sca uh, Shatter Strike scaling does more damage now than Advancing Strike. Alright, are we full spending this for the full form of damage? Nope. He's gonna put him on through a little bit here, keep the pressure up. Oh, I yeah, love the parry nice once again, and now you're dead. Yeah, the parry's from Robert coming in real clutch. Which is not something you see too often with Rio. I mean, his parries are strong, right? But the way that we're seeing Robert utilize them, such strong effect here. Oh, he tried it again. Nice. Yeah, DP on my plus frame. Okay. Right back, a taste of his own medicine. DP on my plus frame. So that's a good idea. <laughs> I'll take that, thanks. Shout out to KOF. Alright, there he is. D okay. A lot of damage. Okay. I'm a 400 to start. Now Benny has the corner this is where he wants you. No parry for Robert anymore, though. Oh, checks the back dash there with the 2A. Very nice. I love the neutral jump. You got to be careful, though, because sometimes Benny Mara will roll through with a guard cancel and immediately go for that DP. Oh, he jumping. This is enough to kill. Got yeah, level 2. Get the follow up afterwards. Yeah, nice job. Woo. Dash Boy actually really that almost took that there. With had four bars, literally all it took was one hit. But Robert played a little bit more solid on the ground. Yeah, and uh, Benny Maru definitely helped in that matchup as well, right? Benny Maru, his so versatile, has incredible range there, and can just kind of stay out of the danger zone of Rio. Select order. Let's see, going back to order select. Wonder what we're gonna see here. So we started off with Geese. It was Geese, Orochi, Yashiro, Ryo was the team. And it looks like we're going to go with that, but Robert's putting Benny on point. Ooh, it's interesting change. I think he thinks the Benny can hold up better in the long run because that Isla Geese matchup did not go the way that he wanted. That's right. So let's see, jumping right into it here in this matchup. Both characters are, in some ways, I feel like Benny Maru and Geese are kind of similar. They play they play almost the same role on the team, you know what I mean? In terms of how safe they can be, the positions that they want to be at. Yeah, the space that they can control with their, their different, you know, quote-unquote projectiles. Woo. Nice, bro. Right, this Benny is doing way more work against the Geese. Yeah, it's able to take the round there, too. Robert starting off strong with the lead. Yeah, that was good stuff. The Benny choice to switch the point was really smart for Robert. Okay. Oh, goes for the air throw immediately. Uh oh, seems like Robert is starting to call out Thrash Boy's habits here. Getting a little in his head. Found it. He's like, you're not Reno. I'm not scared. <laughs> oh, the whip shatter strike is gonna get punished there. Oh, oh tried to my the advanced God. strike. There's the downside of it. The startup takes a while, meaning that you can react with a roll, and if you roll through it, you get a free punish. Oh no. It begins. 
Alright, we got a guess per game on the next one. Bop, bop. Here we go, overhead, yep. Oh. Such a key round right now for Thrash. Boy, you cannot allow Roshi Yashiro to fall here. There it is. Yep, checking with the 5B harassment and able to take down Benny Morrow, but taking a lot of damage in the process. But as Oyash, uh, all it takes is one. Truly, all it takes is one. Oh. Oh, waited out the ferry this time. Good adjustment from Thrash Boy. And now begins the blender. Okay. Forward roll to DP into you die. <laughs> Bro. Well, here we go now. Set point for Robert. Just needs to take down one more Rio. Okay. One brain cell. Nice. Getting that DP. Ooh. Tried to jump to the other side, but gets blown up for it. Throws out another DP, relieve a little bit of that pressure. Yo! Oh, nasty. The play right now from both of these videos is sick. No dash blocking. No dash blocking. All right. Both anchors coming out. Ryo does have a good chunk of health. So it is doable. Yeah, but Isla is going to be able to just maneuver around Ryo all day. As long as Robert doesn't take any unnecessary risks, he should just be able to whittle down Thrash Boy. But no, gets hit by the EX punches. That's that, that's that mix box spend. Spend it, spend it. Okay, no, we're gonna hold on. Understand. Oh, nice block. Nice block. Wow, weathering that whole storm there. And there's the clean jump in with the right oh, round. Head. He Yup, oh my god, all it takes is one from Thrash Point. We have tied it up, 1-1. One, one. That is what I like to see. Competitive set here. Ryo, the dragon, looking so good in this meta. Yeah, really. Now the question is, does Robert move his team around again? That is a good question. I mean, Benny did a really good job, right? Oh, we're going back to member select. Oh boy. Are we taking out the Isla? Is that it? That'd be kind of crazy, but I could see it. I could see taking out Isla. She has been kind of the weakest link of the team when it comes to performance. Oh, no. no. We're bringing we took out the Rio for the Rock. Not Rio, huh? Oh, Isla back in front. Benny on anchor. And Orochi Yash this time on point. Geese just wasn't cutting it. I mean... Oh. <laughs> Robert's... Robert's a little toxic, all right? Look at that. Look at his uh his player tag. His oh, title. I don't know if they up. show it. I forgot if they show it in the actual match. They should. Should just be directly. Oh, we can't read it. No. Yeah, Pain. it's, it's a beginner. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Listen, you just got to let him know. <laughs> beginner with the immortal rank. Exactly. Oh. All right, we're just trying to play this spacing game. I feel like this is when you actually can kind of go in on Orochi Yashiro, right? When he doesn't have that bar, meaning that his confirms aren't going to be as scary as they would be otherwise. Yeah, for real. But all he, he builds a lot of meter from his command grab. And now he's got the one bar to set it all into motion. Nice. No advanced strike. Oh! The read on okay. the back roll. Yes, for your life here now, Robert. Command grab. Nope. Let that DP rip is so scary, but I mean, what have you got to lose? He's so nearly already dead. There we go. And with 20 seconds left on the clock here, Rochi Yashiro is not going to get much back for health. Yeah, but maybe that was the round that he needed. We need to see how this rock performs, but Oyash does have... One Ready? access to one bar. Oh. 
Oh no. Nice! That's a lot of damage. Wow! That's a lot of damage than I thought. Both point characters are knocked out. Alright. Okay, Rock, the I bar see Got rid of the Oyash, though. Well, oh, now it's father versus Ready? son here. Dang, they both got the same hair color, too, in this. Yeah, they grew. Oh, I love that cross-up, but we immediately went into the elbow upon landing. All we needed was a button there to confirm it. Look at your health bar. All it takes is one more. 2C One. trades. Oh! Oh, that's so scary. Nice with the far C. Blows your way out of the corner. Get this confirmed with EX overhead kick. Oh, tries to go for a reset with Rage Run. Oh, that's a punish. That's going to be enough to take the round. And Robert in the lead all of a sudden. Yeah, that almost went terribly for Robert there with Thrash Boy letting that confirm, putting Robert into the corner. But able to weather the storm. One well placed far C was all you need. And now let's see if we can take down the dragon here. Yeah, the dragon of Dojima. <laughs> oh, bro. Oh my god, I was so scared. I thought we were about to get a link off that parry. Yeah, the, oh my god. No, that is a tragic drop there. It's all right. You still have another character left. Oh, no. <laughs> that was even more damage. Bro, oh my god. Risk it all. And now we are back to where it all started in game one with Ryo versus Benny. Okay. I want to say slightly uh, Robert uh, favored here going in with Benny Maru. Let's see. We're great trade. All right, guess for game. <laughs> I think even the X command grab kills here. See? Again, Robert not taking any unnecessary risks here. I like that. You look at the meter that's there on Thrash Boy's side, any straight hit will kill you, but there we go. Level two coming through. Just like Straka Man coming through with the five dollars in the match arena. Thank you so much. That one's for you. <laughs> that empty jump low is for you. Exactly. <laughs> Good stuff to Robert, clutching it out in the end. I think Rome was also one of the ones who was still playing Andy. Ready? Oh, of course. Rome's a, an Andy stand. Yeah, so is Mike. <laughs> also, yeah, Dark Angel been playing a lot of Shunye. Been hearing about his escapades as of late, and I think this character is just getting better and better. We're back to uh, the KOF 14 3.0 days. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Nangay's beautiful challenge there. One of the big things about shooting is just his mix-up can be really overwhelming on point. You don't have really any meter to, to blow it up or to go for any of those guard cancels. Oh, yeah, there it is. Not enough to kill, but this is the start. Oh, he said Matt. universal command grab? No. Yeah, who needs advancing strike when you can just neutral jump? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. Speaking of advancing strike, that's a shadow strike. Let's see what Mr. Bogart can do here. Raz. Get opened up, that's what. Bro, yeah, opened up from the dome. The overheads are so scary. Yeah, there's another one. Oh! We're anime characters now. Nice. What the, was that his JB? I have never seen that normal. <laughs> Bro, Shune is out here playing Guilty Gear, alright? Not KOF. Look at this. And your guard gauge, you can't walk it forever. Goes for the jump out. We didn't get to the super there. Nice we, weren't, we didn't believe. Oh! Tragedy strikes once again. Dark Angel trying to cook up an OCV. The, the mixing up of the movement options, so good. Shout out to giving this character a fastball. Bro, nasty work, nasty work. But let's see, what is Kim gonna be able to do? Ooh, nice block on the low. Woo! That catches Bro. forward roll? Oh, it's this, this character's OD. He called out the guard cancel with that. Unbelievable, able to score the low. It's looking like an OCP is gonna be more and more likely. Spends the level one and there it is. Woo!
Now that's an anime character. Yeah, he, uh, he definitely has some overwhelming offense for sure. Now, now if we see this going into SWC, that's going to be one hell of a run that Dark Angel might, might take. I have a feeling uh, that the Shune Isla shell is going to be really popular. It's going to be very popular going forward. I mean, there's also uh, Rockling Kyo, who will, right. will potentially be at the last chance qualifier. Could be another potential Shunie to uh, make it into SWC. Round one. Ready? Go! Let's right, see how Blue Mary is going to be able to handle this. Able to get the first blood there with a throw. Ooh. Yeah, Mary was the one character that gave Shunie some trouble, but maybe Dark Angel just needed the game to get the download. Oh my god, what a pickup. Okay. Yes, I love the wake up throw option. Catching the roll, but not able to get a punish on it. Instead, you're going to be the one who gets punished. Nice. What the? That frame kill was insane. Ah! Not the advancing strike out of nowhere. Oh my god. So many straight hits, but no confirms. Didn't build enough. What's the mix? Ah! Catches the roll. Not terrible, though. Not a terrible performance from Paraz, right? We were nearly able to take down Shune, and now we just need one confirm here. Kim yeah, just has to breathe on it. You just need one EX flash kick. That's all it takes. It's one. Ooh, nice. Hung it done. No, he's so good, though. Landed right into the low. Gets clipped at the overhead again. Just this don't get wrong. Nice. No, he's so prepared. Bro, the moment that thing goes south, he immediately puts them back into his favor. And there we go. Shune is finally down and out. But now here comes k -Dash. Yeah, the Dark Angel character of all time. Ready? He's so prepared to catch every single defensive option. It's insane. Protect there. This goes for the EX flipping. Smart play right now from Paraz. Backing up, creating that space. Don't want to get caught in a brawling match here with K-Dash. Because that is what can happen to you. That's all it takes. All it takes is one. Dark Angel just controlling space while still slowly moving forward. The usage of jab to catch those hops is really good. Ready? Absolutely. Go. Now it's all up to Mr. Andy Bogart. And what the question is, what does he do? So he gets hit. Yeah, overwhelming offense that K-Dash can put out. We do have that DP available. We have a slow moving fireball that we can follow behind. Yo sends it out. Not gonna be able to get a pickup off of it, but still gets this pressure in the corner. Dark Angel's out. Out for three, too. Oh, gets no. Jump in. Gets a hard knockdown off of this. Nice tech. Like, nice block, though. Next kick can kill, though, for Dark Angel if we get the right confirm. Oh, the jump! Nice! Yeah, He's gonna be so much damage! You're dead? Oh no! I thought I got a DP off of that for some reason. Oh, but he gets clipped low! Ooh, not enough to get the kill though. But that was a beautiful response there from Paraj. Just an unfortunate jump from Dark Angel. I think maybe we wanted a short hop and got the full jump instead. That CD came out pretty early. Yeah, yes it did, but we still have one more character to go. Isla still has three bars. So literally any hit will lead to death. Can you do it, Andy? Can you do it? Oh boy. Don't get opened up. Nice blocks. No! Oh, a ran under. Ran under and run over. Dark Angel is going to take it 2-0 and move on in the bracket. All it took was one. He just played consistent enough to find the one hit and then the run under mix-up. 
Really strong showing from Peraz, though. He's really holding it down right until the end. Yeah, with a really unique and fun names scene. in this top eight, which is going to be really cool to see. Round one. Ready? Go! Buddy, sad. Here we go, on hell, on point. Again, we, we mentioned it so many different times that in a game where it feels like you could really play anyone in any position, there are a few like on hell who is 100% a point character at heart. And also, shouts to Lucas with the five dollars in the match, Reno. Thank you. Yeah, on hell is almost exclusively a point character. Doesn't really have a lot of usage for meter and doesn't really want you to escape any of her pressure with your defensive stuff. That was a mash on an auto combo. <laughs> Counter into the people's elbow. Nice. That's the rock. Smackdown last night. Woo! The roundhouse of the century. A very solid first round there. What a way to start this off. All right. The Hanako coming out, eyeing up her opponent. Can she see above her cleavage? Woo. Here we go. Here's the mix. Huh. Boing. Oh no! The counter hit of the century. Oh my God. Cross up and the overhead. Unreal. The stun into the finish. Bro, Leon Vaughn. That was crazy. That was crazy. This is, this is kind of nutty what we're seeing. And, and on Hell OCB. Listen, these are, the these are the people who never stop playing this character. Woo! What a trade. Oh, oh no. Strike, but unfortunately, with you get punished for it. Nice block in the cross and attempt at the elbow. Nice. Mogi not out of it yet, but needs to get through a bunch of characters. Nice. Yo, Lee and Evan punching their ticket out of this corner, though. Oh, my God. Guess. We're just waking up with the DP. I like it. And we are able to prevent the OCV. That's a moral victory, all right? Yeah, it really is. It's going to be really difficult to make this full comeback with only about two bars and 25% health remaining. Yeah, two bars and a dream. Never mind. <laughs> the dream's dead. Yeah. You never had a dream that? Nope. <laughs> I've never dreamed once in my life. <laughs> we don't sleep, okay? That's true. Never sleep. We're not sleeping until uh, the end of the weekend of March 1st to the 3rd. You're right, you're right. <laughs> well, here we go, order back select. to order select, select here for tool. Fumogi. Do we just want to breathe there, or are we going to swap things up? We'll play Hanako in front. Oh, Terry in front. Ooh, Terry up front. I kind of like that, actually. Get ready for Wants that big button to keep on hell away. Yeah, for sure. Standing D, standing C, both going to be really good. Uh, JCD going to be amazing. Yeah, for That's sure. That's like a lot of uh, on hell's movements is you know based on around her jumps. Mm -hmm. I think Ooh. even his standing D is pretty decent. Yeah, absolutely. Nice. Now we can play that chase down game, right? That's exactly what we're doing. We're chasing down with burn knuckle. Oh, sick! Nice block on the overhead though. Yeah, the punishment for 2B. You got to be careful about the spacing on that burn knuckle. You could have gotten blown up for it in a bigger way. Nice trade. Oh, there's the punish on the burn knuckle that we were looking for before. You gotta watch out what the? Cross. Whoa. Yeah, we definitely wanted to go through there. Oh, no. Risk but, it all. Yeah, risked it all and lost it all too. Therefore, Terry Mogi down a character now. Still has to put on hell away. Question is, does Inako have it? Nice. What the? Ooh. What oh the? Oh my God! No help! Help! <laughs> yeah, help! I'm being run down by a ninja. Yo. 
patience. Jumps to the other side. Oh yeah, just reset God. after reset here. Leon Vaughn just kind of playing with his food. The sauciness. No. Oh, no. Gets the guard cancel. No punish. Nice. Able to score the throw. Hinako still in this. Getting some health back on top of it as well. All right. Fumogi still in this. Still has another chance. Much more even this time. Okay. I should stop talking. <laughs> the commentator's curse coming through. There's the drop kick. Ooh, gotta watch out. So scary. It's trying to escape from the corner here, but we are able to do it. <laughs> Bro, there it is. This advancing strike, I feel like, is going to be very strong against certain grapplers right yeah if you could call it the command grabs you get a free combo for calling it out you don't even have to go for a neutral jump that's pretty good uh, i wonder how it's going to affect clark <laughs> we might you know we might find out when shadow x comes on stream right for sure nice okay oh no oh, wow. with the cd nice punish there from the armbond might be able to kill here? A dead? Oh. Yeah, okay. now you're done. Just 2-0, and Leon Von makes it in the top eight winner side. Yeah, looking incredibly strong. Oh my god, looking at some of these uh <laughs> some of these matches coming up, right? Yes. Round one. Ready? Go! Alright, starting things off with A Dash on point. Against Isla. Oh, nice, JD. Oh, Ooh. no. Huge start for your Shadow X now. Robert, unfortunately, is throwing away all that health for peaking early. Sometimes you gotta take those risks. Sometimes you're a genius, and sometimes it's oh no. Nice block. Love the usage of the whip cancel there to move forward. Oh my god. We spent the meter too. He's expecting some kind of punish. Maybe he's expecting to chase him up to the skies there and go for a stylish punish. I have no idea what that was. Maybe he wanted to catch him catch him sleeping on maybe like a dash forward or something. Yeah, I could see that too. Okay. Robert betting a whole lot on DPs. The question is, will it pay off? Yo, nice block and instant overhead. There's the sweep. Being a little patient there, trying to bait out some kind of a reversal. Oh, oh, oh you're dead. Yes, you are. Final Just hit enough, there. yeah. Oh, Johan's saying that Xiao Hai showed you can shatter strike. You can grab shatter strike to beat <laughs> advancing strike. So you can just do the grab, and then if you see the the slowdown, you just do shatter strike. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> yeah, this, you know, it deserves it. All right, DP hit its mark. Nice. I love the jump back there. Whoa. That was a, a nutty hitbox. Style. All that hell's gone. But the K dash did more than enough work. Yeah, plenty. Plenty, plenty, plenty. Let's see. Clark, time to come on in. Oh, jab, shatter strike. Okay, my bad. I read that it's grab for some reason. <laughs> tried to, you know, tried to beat out a potential grab with the advanced strike. Nice. All right, nice standing C. Nice blocks. Four bars. Oh, boy. Woo! Anything is going to hurt. There's the whip. Goes yeah. straight into the quick max. Oh, you're dead, by the way, I think, actually. I think so. This should do enough. You know, if Oyash can kill here, maybe Clark should be able to. Yeah, you're dead. Thank you. <laughs> I still remember that clip. That clip was... Uh, I don't want to think about that clip. I know the exact one you're talking about. Yeah. You know what ended up on Will It Kill? 
It did? Oh, yeah. man. That ended up on Will It Kill. Which episode? I gotta go watch that after this. I was it was like the latest one, because I think I watched it while I was at Frosty's. <laughs> it's literally the first clip of the episode. It's so nasty. It's just... It's just a disgusting clip. Please, if you haven't seen it, go watch that episode of Will It Kill to see it. <laughs> this, that character's wrong, bro. Orochi is wrong. <laughs> oh, man. That's too funny. All right. What are, what are we getting as a switch here? Yeah, I'm curious to see what Robert's thinking. Shadow X just chilling. <laughs> Hasn't picked the characters yet. But that was, uh, yeah, so the, the, the interesting thing or the unfortunate thing about Clark is sometimes it's hard to gauge whether or not it's going to kill, right? Because yeah. he does get a lot of scaling on his quick max combos compared to some other characters. That's why you normally don't see people go for his level 3 a whole lot. Yeah, exactly. Oh, Shadow but went to character select. Oh, excuse me. Oh, he's taking his time. What's happening? Oh, boy. Maybe something happened? Because... Oh. Maybe you had to run and do something because yeah, maybe. normally when you win, you don't you can't go to character slot. <laughs> yeah. Maybe he had to go switch out his laundry. I, you know, I need to do that too. <laughs> it's sitting in there right now. So do I. It's the weekend, bro. It's laundry day. Every day is laundry day, bro. It never ends. You can't finish doing laundry. It's just not possible. It's true. There's too many clothes. Well, let's especially, see. Someone's about to get washed here. Oh. <laughs> the question right, is, rounds. Robert going to get washed again? That's a good question. I mean, we'll have to see. We are stuck in the black Let's screen. Okay, there uh, we go. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> K-Dash versus Isla to kick things off. Also, uh, Robert put Iori on his team. Yeah, I think that putting Iori is a pretty good call. Just a really solid character all around. Can't go wrong picking him. Yeah, I was gonna say, can never go wrong being a Latin American and picking Yuri. Exactly. In the you DNA. Genuinely cannot be bad with that character. All right. Yep. Goes to the air confirm afterwards. He's already pushed Robert to the corner. And the big thing here that's surprising for Robert is how Isla has been kind of ineffective. Yeah, might be time to pack it up. Oh, maybe right. not. Complicated his first. Woo! The overhead, nice DP out though. Out of harm's way. Stays on the same side, doesn't go for the roll through. Does the roll through that time. Got a weapon ready. Nice, gets the low. A lot of damage, not gonna be enough to kill. What's the mix? Oh, rolls backwards, trying to bait out some kind of a reversal, but the guard cancel into DP Shadow X Nutty yeah, with the gamble. into reversal. Rolling those dice. It's not KOF unless DP on every single frame possible. You are not wrong. <laughs> Whoa. Not what he wanted. Yeah, unfortunate hard commitment there. Maybe cross cut DP was what he wanted. Alright. Even game. Isla put enough work in on the K dash for the Benny to finish it up. Okay. And if he did. EX tackle. DDT. We're going for the Oki option here. Empty jump. Close C. Okay. Nice. Ooh. Saw the air throws a bunch against the Oyas. I love the Frankenstein. Yeah. You got two bars to advance strike, but are you going to get the chance to do it? Or if you even feel confident in going for it, right? One call out and Benny Maru is history. Oh. Ooh, the check there. Yeah, I can't believe that jab actually worked. Nice box. Three bars on the Benny. Oh, the empty jump one frame again. Shadow X catching Robert sleeping at the wheel. Fantastic stuff we're seeing here from Shadow X. Now sitting at set point. Threatening to send Robert down to losers and qualify for top eight winner's side. Still has Iori waiting in the wings, too, as backup. Nice. Gonna go all the way to the corner with the rolling death cradle. Nice. Out of there. EX with the OTGs, yep. 
Ooh, the OS! Oh, nowhere to go, nowhere to run. Back is up against the wall. How are you gonna fight your way out of this one, Shadow? Oh. Ooh, it's all right, just... Robert, Robert accidentally put himself in the corner. That was a beautiful backdash too to avoid the Rekka. The spacing from Shadow X is so perfect. What a pickup! You're so good! ET elbow drop for the Oki. Oh my god, it's not gonna be enough to kill. Why, but one more touch is all you need. Gonna end up losing Clark, but that's okay. That is okay, Clark did more than enough here. Look at the clock. Yori's getting barely any health left here. Now has to go into the mirror match. Yeah, it also took two bars from it, but all it takes is one Iori combo. It can literally take a 2C to Rekka OTG and you die. And you're told? Okay. <laughs> just like that. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's just the Iori special. And that is going to be 2 over Shadow X here over ARSW Robert. So going to be moving. Yeah, for sure. Ready? Go! Nice roll. Yeah. My movement's so scary. Yeah, movement's gonna be the key thing here against Kyo, right? You don't want to get caught by those Rekkas. Force him to overextend, force him to chase, and then capitalize. Nice. Yeah, Rekka through the fan. Woo. Oh, that 3D whip could have been real scary. Oh, people keep taking the corner. Oh, tries to go for the CD. Look at that chase down with the slide. Nice. Oh, yo, the immediate mash into EX up kick. He was so ready for that one. Uh -huh. Gets enough meter just at the end there for the full confirm. Oh, that was nasty. That was nasty. Oh, oh again. No! Third time's a charm. Clinches the first round. Okay, okay, I like what we're seeing here. I like the sh movement that we're seeing, the mix ups that we're seeing, the reset that we are seeing from Lewis Cha. Yeah, I mean, I've, I haven't seen a Mai really abuse the wall slide Oki like uh, Lewis Cha did right there, three times in a row. Oh, that's a bit, yeah, that's mad negative. Oh, it just gets clipped by the DP. Light DP coming through from DK. Able to shut down Mai, but now time to bring out Yuri. Sibling rivalry. Reach for the top. Ready. The music change too. Oh yeah, because this is an uh, art of fighting song. Both these characters get like trucks. Yuri with the better mobility though, of course. Also harder execution. Yeah, very much harder. And her effective ranges is probably a little bit smaller than Ryo's uh, when you're up close because they did change some of her hit confirms. Yeah, don't overextend here. You have the corner, but there we go. One one place jump out from EK. Gets the anywhere juggle as well with the EX. Okay. Yes. Go forward. Get me out of here. Oh, that dive kick uh, broke space and time. <laughs> oh, nice, oh. yeah. Zuna drop. Most of the parry on the fireball, just building up a little bit of meter. Oh, nice to see. Reach to the heaven. And, uh, you know, thanks for the fireball. Here's my guard cancel roll, and I'll take the round. Yeah, you got to be careful about ending the strings with fireball, especially when your opponent's sitting on a lot of meter like that. It is asking Ready? to explode. A universal KOF thing. Do not end your strings in fireball if your opponent has one bar and they are ready to react with guard cancel roll. Because you will eat a full combo. Oh, a little too early on that 2C, but the hitbox interaction is so weird that BK was able to get the throw. Nice counter. That's going to be enough. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. Get the install for Andy. That was dope thinking. Very great awareness there from BK. May the 
and you're gonna be able to get that meter back also right so now having just a buffed rock is gonna be massive here in this anchor war yeah in my head i was like why did he do that and i was like oh yeah install carries over for out yeah that is a buff added to the last patch of the oh. current one. so much damage into the reset okay i like that meaty cd we threw out right to get those plus frames Guard, guard, bar. Oh! Yeah. Where are you running? Yo, where, where are you, you going? Running? Fireball's not fast enough, though. Oh, Shadow, Shadow Strike, strike out! out! Not out of it yet. The you OTG with perfectly. the fireball. You have to play perfectly, though. You can't afford to even block a couple fireballs. You have them right where you want them. No, Shadow we Strike, you more time, but we win! What a it feels so bad. Tried to commit to a full combo and a Shatter Strike at that spacing out of the corner. Not like this. Almost had it. He almost had yeah. it. That is the tragic part. Just did not want that DP. Didn't get the, the break cancel that he wanted. That feels so bad. It's alright though. You can't let that shake you. Gotta keep going. Keep rolling. For what it's worth though, Louis Shaw is playing like crazy. I was the 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 chase down with the EX elbow to try to get out of the guard break situation was so smart from Louis Cha. Mm -hmm. Nice trade! Wow, what a pickup! All right, again, slow pace match here in the point war with my versus Kyo. But man, that, that cross up there in the corner with the JB. Yo, she might be sick. And another knockdown right into the other corner. Yo, the walk up throw. Yo, bro, my god. Yo, the corner pressure from Luis Cha. The fact that VK was able to weather that as long as he did is honestly incredible. But Lewis Cha with a massive, massive lead right now up against VK. Rio's going to have to put in overtime to make this work. That immediate wall cling dive kick really caught me off guard. I've never seen people do that. I've never seen Mai do that, yeah. Yo, stay in the corner. Where are you going? Nice match from Louis Cha. Gets another knockdown because that is a hard knockdown now. Nice cross cut. Ooh. Just raw EX Rekka. A lot of damage. Nice match. Right, sliding right on in. Keep it safe. Oh. This is such a key round for VK. You don't want to go down two characters. But Luis Cha recognizing that again, not making any unnecessary take any unnecessary risks, right? Yeah, it doesn't really need to. The time going down here is enough for Mai to get that extra credit on Rio. Yeah, very negative, but 11 seconds left. Means Rio is not getting a whole lot of life here. And now, music change. Round three. Ready? Go! All it takes is literally anything from Yuri. Nice to see. Oh! Oh no! Why? I think VK that was just the EX machine gun fist. VK is the king of DPs, yet DPs are there is downfall in this match right now. Louis Shaw with a whole character lead. I don't even know if that was plus. I've never actually seen Yuri do that on block. Nice 2C. Okay, we're in there. Are we going to install? Yeah. Yep, there it is. 
You gotta let it rip at this point, right? You need to pick up for lost ground. Alright, the install is on. Set up the fireball. Oh, boy. Still, this is scary, right? You have one bar here for Rock. Up against Yuri with three and a half. Any yeah, and stray hit can spell death. Yeah. All it takes is really one and a half bars from Yuri for her to do 500 damage. Nice 2C. Catching Louis Shaw jumping. Whoa! The EX grab from so deep. No 2C that time. Takes out the 2C with the dive kick there. Here to air situation. It's still guard cancel to get out. VK trying to hold on for dear life, but that is going to be it. Luis Cha 2 0 over VK. Moving on to top the eight winners. It's going to be interesting to see, that's Ready? for sure. So many interactions to think about when labbing something like that. It's time SK put in replay takeover. For sure. All right, slide is going to get blocked. Not a huge punish, though. Only got the 2A. Nice. In there. In there again. Oh. Oh. What a delayed match from Shadow X. All right. Yo! He's so smart! Breaking so Star Heavy! The, the the run up, run stop right outside of range to delay jump to to catch the jump back and or roll back there was so smart. He's a genius. Woo! Oh, there's backbreaker. Getting the elbow drop. See? Weathering this storm of offense here from Isla. Doesn't even get punished there on the whiff turn punch. Uh, you know, wishful thinking. <laughs> nice jump. Look at the spacing you're seeing from Shadow X2. Just staying right outside of hop range to get that deep hop. He's able to get in there with the throw. I love the whiff, JB, or JC, excuse me. Oh. Shout out to Dead Zones on the far C. Not enough. That's not enough to kill. Yeah, they buffed the damage. It's not enough to kill, but it's going to throw him back into the corner. Okay. Whiff shatter Strike. But again, you see, even like a whiff Shatter Strike, very difficult to punish, right? Not compared to the advancing strike. Standing D, though, is going to be enough with the boot upside Isla's head to put Shadow X now at the position to close out game number one. For the top. Ready? The potential one park victory. This is an interesting whip color. Purple and orange. It's like a nightmare for Christmas character. <laughs> Woo! The crosscut Frankensteiner. What a term. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Oh, okay. The empty jump EX command grab. The Amon's just getting scooped here, Cookie. Goes for the rolling death cradle. Oh my god, Leon Von just jumped right into Clark's clutches. Oh! That was about to be sick. Yeah, lands a throw of his own. Just like this, our OCB dreams may be gone. But no! They the are so back! We are We're so back! back. We're so back! Their opponent in that match. We've, we've done it. The one Clark victory. The first Saturday KOF TNS, the and we've done it. <laughs> the Clarkening is here. It can happen to you, chat. You can't escape. Advancing Strike will not save you. No, not in these streets. <laughs> but let's see now. It looks like we're going straight into the rematch. No order select, no character select needed. Leon is confident in the team. Ready? Ooh, no fear, round start. The immediate run up deep pop, but there it is. All right, in the corner. Woo! Oh, definitely driver. Where are you going? No advantage strike like to save you from that one. I, I 
curious how Advancing Strike interacts with that since it has armor, to be honest. You should, you should be able to can uh, cancel your attack into it, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh, if I'm wrong, but you're wrong, you're dead. Never mind. Actually, would EX tackle have caught there? I'm, I'm not too certain. I feel like it might have been able to, yeah. but Shadow X just wanted to save the meter, possibly. So There you go, 2C to punish the whiffed advancing strike. It's still going to take players some time to get used to when and how to use advanced strike, right? The, the voice line there. Woo! As she completely whiffs. She was so excited about it. So excited. There's the elbow drop. Goes for the empty jump and gets tossed this time. Ooh. Oh no, gets opened up. Only an Evan has a chance. Okay. I like the, the liberal use of advanced strike to try to call out different timings that Shadow X might be trying to get out of here. Punish. Okay. Maybe I'm I'm the one who's wrong. This is a lot of damage. Oh, turn punch into whiffing standing D. Okay, the close D. Bro, That's what? Not what he wanted, but still ends up getting out of there. Ah! Oh, too far away to get the command grab. Unfortunate. Clark put in plenty of work, though. He was Clarking, all right. Yeah, he was Clarking. Now that we finally see the K dash. But is it too little, too late? I don't think so. I think you know we're not too far away. One confirmed, just like this, things are evened up. Crazy. Yeah. Now, uh, you know, Lee and Evan with the lead. Keeping Shadow up X. the pressure, not letting Shadow X get away. Yeah, really on the back foot here. Trying to create some space to get some breathing room. There we go, finally, with a fireball. But now we're going to be able to capitalize on this situation. Clean that jump in. Jump in. No, not, not enough. Yeah, that scaled really hard. Oh, the instant overhead JA. And it just worked. The Let K it rip. special. <laughs> when in doubt, minute spike out. Exactly. Godspeed. Well, let's see now. Is Whip going to be able to take this the distance? It's all up to Whip. Oh, that's a good start. Never mind. Woo, that's an even better start. That's enough to kill. Ends it all. Get that K dash out of here. All right. Finally, down to the anchors. Last shot here for Leon Von to stay alive in top eight winner side. Please go up against the Yori with a lot of meter. Oh, if you get hit, you're dead. Oh, yeah, there you, you go. said it. That should be it. Yeah, no, we kill, don't. Because it wasn't EX Fireworks. Yeah, I feel like if we went for the Fireworks, we might have been able to get the kill there, but... Wanted to go for the safer routing. I understand. Now, not choosing to extend at all, because he knows that Lee and Evan have to come to him. That's all it took. The one jump in to run up Frame Trap close C. Shadow X makes a 2-0 over Lee and Evan. Yeah, there you go. Like if just stand jab or stand B, we'll just like beat it out outright. Mm -hmm. Great rundown. Nice. Can be a big part is how can Louis Shaw operate or uh, police the air movement? I really liked after that throw tech there that we immediately went for the CD, right? It put us uh, all the way back mid screen. But you gotta be careful with the movement that you're seeing because Dark Angel is willing to kind of pop and follow you until you corner yourself in a lot of cases. Yeah, his, his movement is really good. So, and it really is uh, up to Lou's shot to, you know, try to mimic that movement or try to police that movement as much as possible, but not doing a lot of it right now. Not gonna be enough to kill. You get another mix up. Well, and the chip damage. damage is gonna be enough to do it. That wind pose is so weird to me. <laughs> just, just, you know, fe feeling himself, I guess. I mean, look, look at him, alright. 
to what he's wearing. Yeah, I know. He's got one pant leg up. Clearly, no one in China told him that, that was bad. Oh, nice. Facing. So on point. Able to catch the guard cancel afterwards, too. Oh, my God. The walk down from Louis Shaw, but wasted the two bars on Quick Max. Oh, man. Dark Angel is finding the ways in. Yo, the button presses. Ooh. I love that CD. Able to jump over the super. There's the punish. Bro, that routing. <laughs> DP into the pickup afterwards. The Yuri special, Ready? but here is the K-Dash. Here's Cha disposing of the Shunie. You know, faster than we've seen other people do. So, already off to a great start. But Yuri does not have a lot of meter. She kind of wants that to do her big, big damage. Speaking of big, big damage, you're about to take it. Goodbye, Yuri. Just gets the easy jump in afterwards. K-Dash going to be at full health and a full character lead for Dark Angel. Let's see what we can cook up here with two bars. Woo. Picked up. Nice confirm there from Dark Angel. Again, just pushing Luis all the way to the corner. There's the guard cancel to get out. Trying to flip things around. Oh, stole the corner again. What a jab check. That's really scary. Really scary for Luis's chances here. Dark Angel is able to check those elbows like that. It's one of Andy's strongest tools to just get through neutral. Nice! That throw is so weird. Why does he slow down in midair like that? <laughs> Let's go for that fastball. Slow fall. <laughs> it's, like, it's like slow motion, like you throw him off a building. This. You have to make something happen, though. The clock is running down. You're going to get no health back, even if you can take down Kada. That's not what is going to happen here. Dark Angel takes game one. Man, Louis Trow was trying so hard, but Dark Angel's defense was just too tight. Dark Angel up 1-0. Do we see a switch from Louis Cha, or are we committing? That's a oh, wow. Right in. No <laughs> time to one. think. Bro, he was mashing that. <laughs> He's like, I must go again. I must show them I am not washed. <laughs> It is the kids who are washed. Round one. All right. The movement rematch of the century. Ooh. All right, gets the hard knockdown. And it begins. Here Anime comes. blender. Yep, the pain train. See, we have a grappler blender, and then Tunie comes in and is like, yeah, but I have my own blender. It, it is just anime pressure. Yeah. It really oh! is. With the instant air dash is catching you with the low altitude air dash, and Mai is just gone. The Mai that we've been praising so much this afternoon just run over by Shune. Yeah, I feel like I'm watching these tag pressure right now. <laughs> Oh, the DP gets caught. There's a lot of damage. What? That hit that high. Worked out for Dark Angel. But that did cost him a bar. Get out of here. Man, we, we stay taking the corner on these corner jumps. We do, but so far, Luis doing a really good job just counter punching here up against Dark Angel, trying to make those advances. That CD hits so high. Oh. oh! Chase down. Or the chase back, I should say, with that rollback. But there we go, finally able to get a button in. Knocks down Shune a peg and now has to fight K Dash. 
Yeah, that uh, that rollback and then the immediate Louis Cha roll forward was like the sixth sense. Again, yo, Yuri, with the lead right now, that did so much damage. This might be what Louis Cha needs. The roll, the 4 me. Oh my god. Bro, your life. Your life is gone. And now Dark Angel threatening to send Louis Cha down to the loser side of the bracket. Let's see, Andy again, it is all up to Andy. But this time with way less health on the K-Dash. Yeah, this oh, is so no. doable. But this combo is gonna make it a little harder. It's called the roll, the patience from Dark Angel, patience of a saint. No, the roll gets caught again. You have to hold this, the EX blackout to left, right mix up. No matter what this you do, bro, there is no world escape, world. nowhere to run. Dark Angel taking another victim. The Reaper. Quite the path to take if they want to make grand finals. The low cost starting off like crazy right now. The pressure. Have health already. Jesus. How many times am I going to keep seeing the same pressure string? Do it again. Woo. 2C whiff. 2D hit though. Throw kills. Nice. BK finally found a way out. Oh, it might not matter though. Chip will kill. All the way to the other corner. BK finally in control. That was insane. That start. Man, how did VK actually take that round back? What? How did how did he do it? He was getting clapped on for the first 20 seconds, and there it is. And he actually somehow made that round back. Let's go. Okay. Oh, I like that projectile invulnerability. A lot of damage. Good stuff to low cost. Yeah, keeping the pressure up too. Trying to swing out with that big standing C. There's the shatter strike hitting its mark. We just go straight for the DP, huh? Gets a good OP off that. And Jahibi coming through with a ten dollars to the match. Reno, thank you so much for the support. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, in a slight lead here, but all it takes is one hit from Benny Maru. Nice with punish. Oh! Oh! The advanced strike at work! What the? Yeah, remember, the armor doesn't start up for a little bit longer. It's not like Shatter Strike, so you can stuff people out of it if you're quick enough. But able to get the super, getting rid of Brock. Yeah, good stuff. Lokov finally taking the lead after somehow losing that first round. Nice, DPing through the last hit of the record there, finding the gap. The Lokov has to play a perfect game. Oh, the plus frame goes for the low afterwards. You can't press after it. Okay, wasn't ready. Oh, the low again. Yeah, have my low. I really like what we're seeing from Lokov. He, he is so willing to just utilize the new mechanics, right? <laughs> Throwing out that advanced strike. Immediately labbing it. Man was awake midnight time when it dropped. Nice! Uh, again, advanced strike takes 50, uh, it takes 50 bar, so half a, half a bar. 
And if they block it, you get that refund. If they block it, if they block it or get hit by it, you get the bar back. Woo, you're dead. DK taking game one. Now with the moon. We're all furries all here. Are on the winner of that fierce hey, speak for yourself. A winner! <laughs> oh, here we go. Good stuff from VK. I know some UL players are in the chat. They're getting ready for Grand Blue. A woo! <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you ain't wrong, though. You ain't wrong. <laughs> Round one. Ready? Here we go, hopping straight into the next game. No delays. Keeping our team the same order. And I love how patient DK is willing to be. Just waits for Lokov to run on in, catches him with the 2B. Up against the wall now. The spacing game that we're playing against Geese is really interesting, right? Because I feel like Geese, def I mean, he definitely has the range advantage against Pio. I think it's uh, in a direct response to the first round of that last game where Lokok literally did the same pressure spring over and over and almost killed VK. <laughs> literally left him with like 10 life left. So I think VK is playing directly in response to that, but it's not gonna matter. The jump over the 3D and that seals your fate. And now Rock coming on in. Let's see if he can even the playing field a little bit here. Again, a very similar vibe from DK, just being very cautious. Cautious about the approach here to low call. Yeah, and he's playing very slow. It is again the delayed Rekka's working out. Yo, oh my god. Tried to bait something out, and then the super delayed Shatter Strike still ended up hitting. Yeah, but unable to really capitalize on it, which is the sad part. And we're right back where we started. Same exact position. Nice. Not really been able to get anything started here pressure wise, and every time we try to steal a turn back with a jump, Lokov is ready with the anti air. Yo, the wreck moves him so far forward. Ooh! Nice! Flame trap with the standing CD. Beautiful stuff from VK. Yeah, that was really good stuff. Nice use of the rage run there to actually confirm off of the CD, too. The patience. Oh. All right. Okay, with corner control. Never mind. He out. Oh, this guy strike works. He's so patient, and then he just lets shatter strikes rip. Right. right. Everyone's gonna think advanced strikes, and he's throwing shatter strikes. Oh, but there's the DP reversal. Rock is down. Down to Iori now here on VK side. Lokov is trying to take this a distance. But let's see if VK can put a stop to the momentum here. Round start. VK only needs one and a half characters to kill to move on over Lokov. Wow, that was fast. Okay, get out of the corner. That could have been huge Bro, the forward movement with the CD Rekka there are so good. Here comes the safe jump. Kind of nasty. Able to block the taco. I love the guard cancel there from Lokov, right? To try and push DK back into the corner. Advance cancel is blocked. React to it. Should be enough to kill. Yeah. Who is going to take the win? Set point now for VK. Can we close it out? I mean, this is four bar Yamazaki coming in. It's going to be pretty difficult, to be honest. All it takes is one hit. Each of these trades going to be in Lokov's favor, just whittling down VK's health, making the next confirm even more deadly. 
Oh, that could have been spelled death. Oh boy. DK finally finding some opening. Cool, but still just getting hit by these stray jabs and this damage is adding up. There it is. That was an auto combo. In. Makes him watch the movie. <laughs> it didn't even match. Level one version. Way more than enough. Shout out to the auto combo from Lokov to take his first game in this set. Hey, auto combos got their place, all right? Yeah, they really do. All right, immediate rematch again, right into it, right into the fire. No but only time one for of these players is coming out unburnt. Round one. Ready? Go! Okay, here it is. The geese starting off strong. Ooh. Oh! The counter whiff. Yo! The raw EX red kick immediately hit. That's a huge combo. Oh, not dead though. Ooh, too predictable. Wanting to get very aggressive. Yeah, well, too predictable. The Shatter Strike is blocked. Still able to close it out. Round two. Ready? Go! <laughs> Okay, DK with a massive lead here. Look up. Where are we going? <laughs> Mans was going on a marathon. Bro, he is just throwing out these fireballs, trying to catch something. Yo. Nice! What a hit confirm. Okay. Alright, again, keep the pressure up. Stealing turns back with these hops, and the JB is going to be enough to get rid of Kyo. Evening up the score here. Just back and forth, a tug of war between these two players. Yeah, it's a really sporadic match, but Lokov did end up bringing it back in. Right, punt right to the slicer there again, backing up afterwards. Doesn't want to get too aggressive here and try and steal turns back. Alright, CD gets the knockdown. Now it's time for BK to start to run some offense. Yeah, BK getting a lot of straight hits there. Wow! Run up EX command grab after the DP break cancel. Immediately stay same side there with the JB. Oh, oh, too high though. Yep, too high. Gets tossed into the corner. This is huge now for VK. Cannot allow Lokov to escape. Oh, the TP gets us right out. Not fully out yet though. Oh, there we go. Yeah, the EXP piece of Lokov have been really, really good. Biding his time. Nice 2D back up and the stand D to catch the jump. Yeah, BK just feeling a little lost right now. Round four. Ready? Go. Set point for Lokov. How we've turned things around. OTG just for a little extra damage. I respect that. There's the quick max off the 2B. Gonna be able to kill here. Yeah, it should be enough. Yeah, spend it all. We go to final game, final round. <laughs> but it's true. But VK has no meter, and Yamazaki has three bars. Yeah, this is not looking too great here for VK, but Yori can build up meter pretty quickly, right? And all we need is level one to get those fireworks. And then the party oh! can't start. The Beautiful whip on it. You're a genius. Unreal. Just running deep in. Yo, 
That's so what we're doing. Are we spending it? Yeah, wow, we are. Alright. Don't. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Oh, it keeps going. Right, and he guess. still has the corner. No, plus frame! Right. Do it again. You have more plus frames. Wow, what a trade. Oh, it sticks out the standing A to far A. Bro, the overhead! <laughs> you only need one more. Or you can do the low snake arm. Catch it's a one touch. One touch for either player here. And there we go. Lokov does it, eliminating VK from the bracket here at top eight losers. Yeah, wow. Great stuff to Lokov there, holding it tight right until the end. With that, I'll see the advanced strike after that whole combo. Round one. Ready? Go. The first thing is going to be Yori versus Isla to kick things off here in our winner's finals. We got, we got default. Never mind, not default colors. I thought that Isla color was default for a second. Yori's default. <laughs> yeah. That's all, Shadow X always uses the default. Oh, that's what makes him even more scary. Oh, oh no. no. Bet it all. That should be a dead Iori. Oh, no, no, no. Not quite has a sliver of health left, but yep, there you go. Instant overhead is going to be able to catch you on the dome. And nearly a perfect there for Dark Angel. Going to have full health back going into round two. Now we see how the K-Dash deals. Nice. Yo, nice rundown. Just watch the full jump come out into the empty jump throw. Bro, you get thrown so far, even with a, a regular neutral throw, right? That it allows you to escape from the corner. But what a DP into a super confirm. Get baited again on the DP, and Dark Angel is getting so much from that. <laughs> Big CD pushing you back to the corner. Shadow X recognizing how dire the situation is and is able to low profile there with the 2B, getting rid of Isla, but took so much damage in the process, Cookie. Yeah, he really did. Oh man, I'm trying to I'm trying to think how he overcomes this, because really all it takes is one shooting aim mix up. He needs to play so good defensively. Okay. You know what? I'm just not even gonna talk. This is match point for player two. I say one word and then he immediately DPs on block. Burn to fight. Ready? Go! Okay. Oh man, gets his roll caught. Nice Frankensteiner. Frankensteiner. Yeah, I mean, having access to a Frankensteiner also, right? Which means that you can't really go for the safe jump options because it is a command grab. Yeah. Woo! No, it ended up not working out. That puts him back in the blender. Quick max. Knows when to stop short. There it is. Throw you right back into the corner. Yo, just jump back to avoid. That should be enough. Yeah, it should be enough yeah. for game one. With the lamest climax in the game. The goddess of victory smiles upon the winner. Winner! Bro's out here with uh, with Agni and Rudra putting in the work. Oh, immediate into it. Wow. Just immediate rematch. Yeah, no fear at all, right? This is going to be a three out of five set. Is the adaptation enough against Dark Angel? That is the big question. The big question is dealing with that Shune, too. I feel like Shune has proven uh, over the past few weeks to be such a huge threat on Dark Angel's team. So many people just don't know how to deal with that pressure. Ready? Go! It's so easy to get lost in the sauce, too, because you have so many different options off of this pressure straight. I mean, this team is just incredible that we have. Such a solid, fundamental team. Isla, Shunei, Benimaru. There really are no glaring weaknesses. 
Yeah, and Shadow X is getting absolutely run over right now. Goodness gracious. Yeah, you're dead. Okay. Wow. Player two the first just like that, Yori getting smoked. Okay. That was uh, whoo. That was a speed run. Got us to Isla any percent. Oh, DP worked out that time. Okay. Again, great spacing here from Dark Angel. Dark Angel is going. Yeah, Shadow is having a really hard time finding any room to breathe. There's another DP. That one works out. But, oh, what a match. Another trade. All of these in Dark Angel's favor. And a giant hit should be enough to kill. Yeah, there you go. That's two characters down. Dark Angel dangerously close to a 2-0 lead here. Shadow X has just been getting overwhelmed by the offense of Isla. Yo, the footsie though. Now let's see. Can we start the Clarkening? Do we get that opportunity? He does have four bars. There it is. EX tackle, rolling death cradle, put you into the corner. Yo, the delayed Frankensteiner, he's so smart. <laughs> Hold up, saving that meter. I mean, you have to save the meter at this point, right? Yo, what a hit confirmed. That was wild. I'm able to get coast to coast on top of that. Dark cancel through, but still going to get blown up by the hop CD. So he got caught whipping Gatling Punch, and I guess we're game. Nice throw. Another throw or overhead can kill. There it is. They absolutely Two straight Dark Angel Winner. with an East Low CV. Bro. <laughs> This is looking a little nasty right now. And then Shadow X immediately rematches. No, Wait, either he knows something we don't, or this man just wants to do something else. I have no idea. Unreal. No delays, no nothing, no order swaps. He, he has to know something we don't. Maybe he knows it's, it's, it's not worth it. Ready? All right, got the scum gale. Good start now for Shadow X. Okay. Nice. Yo, he's actually starting off. We got we got offense. If he runs this back, three goals back to swear to God. Oh. Nice oh, cross, cross cut. Alright, Shadow X locking in. He's oh, locked yeah. in now. <laughs> really, it took two games and he's like, finally, I will wake up. Alright, Shunye. Let's see how the Yori deals. Gets hit immediately. And cross us. Ben? No. And a reversal. <laughs> I can't believe that's his that's one of his reversals, that thing. <laughs> so funny. Alright. Let's see Shune. This is the farthest that we've gotten here for Shadow X. Up to Shune. We have not been able to take him down yet. But we do have a full health K-Dash. This could help a lot. Okay. Full health and the meter advantage is on top of that. But does get clipped by the overhead, and now it is time for Mix-Up City. No, the low. Did he spend the bar here to kill? Yes, he does. Look at that, bro. He's got the mixtape on his hip, the headphones on. And now it is set point. Dark Angel threatening a 3-0. Nice. All right. We have a start for the Clark here. 
But a challenge! Bro. Like, bro, you gave him an inch and he's just like, oh, I see it immediately. Yeah, gonna take a mile. And even the neutral hop, unfazed, Dark Angel is still going to press. And he seems to be right every time. There's the Frankensteiner. He blocked the overhead. He's a genius. He's a genius. And that quick max about to be worth nothing here. Jumps over the Frankensteiner. Unreal. That's going to be it. Three. Oh. Dark Angel over Shadow X. How does he know? How does he know? <laughs> I don't get it. Start watching. Tell him to hop in. Tell him to lock in. Leon Evans title said joystick skills. That's crazy. <laughs> churning, bro. Yeah, he's churning. Churning butter. Woo. Nice. That air throw looks so weird. Yeah, he frame trap there with the ender. Not letting this angel do anything. Oh, immediately guard cancel rolls out. Does not want to deal with any of the pressure. Oh, too high up on that jump, and it was such a good call out too from the Anvon to try and get a punish. Good movement from Luis. So good. <laughs> So good. There go. Yep. Caught with the fan right at the end. The projectile coming through. My lover. Yeah, that's true. The, the, they, have them, they have them on two opposite ends because they're not meant to be together. <laughs> They've had this, this cannon for like 30 years and they still haven't fully fleshed it out. Andy. Never to be a couple again. Look, bro, Andy's just a Sigma, okay? Yeah. <laughs> just a Sigma male. Yeah. I mean, you see his forehead is 14. That's, that's my Sigma. Uh-oh. Getting knocked out of the air. Tries to chase the roll through. Nice CD. Going to get a confirm off of this. Not a lot of damage, but we have the corner positioning is what I would say. Okay, and we push to the other corner. Woo! Bro. Oh no, oh, if that God. worked, that would have been sick. And unfortunately, not working out the way that Luis was expecting, but still, just this overwhelming, unique offense that we're seeing. Able to land into the throw, gets the low, goes for the slide. No frame trap is going to happen this time. Okay, Leon Evans finally finds some ground after taking so much damage on the Isla. Let's see what they can do. They don't have a lot of life here on the Isla, so it might all be down to the whip. Oh, oh anything will kill. Oh. A big slap. Alright. Let's see what this whip can do. Two characters to go through. Nice. Down on the roll. How much do we spend on this? One more. Nice! Gets the other hit! I didn't think he could spend the bar on this. Yeah, able to save some meter there and get rid of Yuri. Now in a really good position to take down Andy Bogard. Yeah, still has a good chunk of bar, but Andy has four and a half. Uh, which means that level three jump scare is going to be a factor. Yeah. Like, literally, if you jump, you die. Yeah, if you, you jump at the same time as him. Nice! No, the easy whip! Why is it so stubby? That is really unfortunate. All that meter lost, too, for Luis. Leonma just running away to let the quick max run out. Very smart. Oh, wow. Three bars still. Another chance to get into that level three off of quick max. Again. Oh, we're getting so close. Just not able to make oh. anything stick. That should be enough to kill. Yeah, level one, you're dead. Damn, good stuff to Leon Evan making the comeback with the whip, taking it one up over Luis Cha. Oh,
Remember, this is the final two out of three match here. So only one life left for Luis. One more chance to see who fights Shadow X in Losers Finals. And look at that. Frame one fight again. I feel like this TNS has had the least amount of order swaps or character select. Listen, <laughs> just they're just ready fight. to go. They get this done early Saturday afternoon, and then they go out and they drink. That's exactly what happened at Frosty's. <laughs> Saturday night, all the tournaments finished, and everyone got hammered. Ready? Go! <laughs> hit, that, hit up that karaoke, you know what I'm saying? Yes! Are we, do we get to sing 22 again? <laughs> hey, come to TNS if we can. Yeah! <laughs> All right, air-to-air -air situation. For Angel, this matchup was kind of suffering last time, so let's see if we can get that early lead. Oh, what a catch. The Angel doing a little bit better this time. Trading more effectively. Still unable to find any of that solid offense though, right? It's just been a lot of nickel and diamond here with straight hits. There's the guard cancel push you into the corner right where Luis wants you. But nice jump out. Yo, go chase down with the 3D. The most effective chase downs of back holes I have seen with Mai have come from Luis. He's just goaded. He's just better. Oh, the shatter strike. Bro, the air movement that we're seeing. Oh, the fireball whip is so big. Oh, no. What a back roll from Luis. He was so ready. He was so ready. He's just better. But now let's see if we can keep this momentum, keep this lead here going against Isla. Oh, this is not a good start. Still alive, and now you're in the corner. You have to hold the next mix up. Oh, I forgot that she had that normal. Oh. Me too. I would have got I was hit. Like, I was like, what was that for a second? That was her 2D one? I haven't seen that in forever. Nice. Yo, Luis Cha ready with the far C. 500 damage to start off. Able to grab the roll this time. Cross to the other side. Not gonna do a lot of damage because of the CD scaling. I like this combo. Oh. oh no! Yeah, of course that fireball ain't gonna connect, right? You have to have a charge fireball for that. Speaking of charge fireball, there it is. Just needs to find one last straight hit. Anything can do it here. And there we go. Gets the jump in. Very nice. Shout outs to the big hurt boxes that Isla does have because of the, the little hands. Now a half health Yuri against the whip. This is Louis Cha's last chance. Oh my god. Bro, your health bar. What happened? Exactly. You can't get hit by that again because she has that much more. Every trade is making me wince a little here for Leon Vaughn. The roll gets caught. No, oh, too high to actually get the pick up from the cross up. Yo! The overhead! Bro, just barely staying alive. 40 seconds left. I don't know if you're going to be out of the orange life. No! Oh boy. Oh boy. It all comes down to this. That's and it. And it's over. <laughs> We're going to a game three. Going the distance. That Truly. What production does not want matchup. right now. <laughs> Shout outs to KOF. <laughs> I mean, this game is a gauntlet, right? It is a long game for sure. It's going to test your metal, Test your endurance. Member select. <laughs> Okay. Who are we going to pull out? Play Hinako. It's fine. I want to see Hinako. You're right. I don't even... Who else is Lee and Evan play? 
I mean, he's like, KOF player, he probably plays half the plays everything. Select order. The Blue Mary! No, okay. Let's hope we don't get some Blue Mary's blues, though, and getting eliminated from this bracket. It's about the to pick be a against party the mine. So On hell, clearly not working out, so let's go up a few tiers. Interesting. I'm curious if it's going to matter, though. Let's see if the adjustment ends up working out. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Round one. Ready? Go! Right, round start situation now. Yo! Oh, oh god, that would have been so insane if we picked up after that. That would have been a clip. Nice jump over. Speedball. Trying to go for that sweet chin music there with a the run up CD. Yo, with the neutral jump. Alright, at the moment, it's, been, it's a little bit of a tug of war. Blue Mary pick up. Pick has not been terrible at the moment. Oh, that far C would have been so good. She can cancel that. Oh! Yo! Bro, all these rolls that we're seeing. The movement from Luis with Mai is unreal. The Leon Bon is un. Unfazed, still just trying to fight back. But now you're stuck between a rock and a hard place. Oh. Yo, it's a beat up! Okay, wow. <laughs> Alright. Round number two coming on in. This is the first time that we've been able to get this big of a lead here against Luis. Three bars on the Yuri, though. Nice. Catch on the rollback. What a trade. Oh. Alright, again, these two Ds just sweep after sweep. They're hitting their mark. That's what matters. Yo, DP out. Oh, but the whiff punish there. Very nice stuff. That's the one downside of her sweep. While it does have great range, it's got a lot of recovery on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The jury almost had full life. Isla coming back in. Be a lot of damage. This is what Leon Evan needs right now. Yeah, I like the guard cancel out. You have tons of meter. Might as well use it defensively. Last thing you want is for Isla to start gaining momentum here. But now we push all the way to the corner. Look at that guard gauge. It's going to be a non-factor. Leon Bon really good. Escaping from the corner and turning things around. Taking down Yuri with a low confirm as well. Yeah, wow. Really, really strong performance over the Yuri. And basically a full character lead for Leon Evan going into this final round. Luis Cha's last chance falling on the shoulders of Andy Bogart. I like the usage of the double jump there to avoid the fireball and also keep your air options open. So smart. Right now, Andy, though, is getting blown up. Able to escape, gets a clean jump in. We're gonna go for the climax. Oh. Bro. Not the that worst, though. Actually, got a combo off of that one. Still so tragic. Another chance. Kill her. <laughs> Not enough! The close seat didn't the kill! Ah! Right, Yo, she lands on the fireball. Final game, final round. Let's see, half health on the Andy. Two and a half bars on this whip. Will it be enough? Not crack now. Look, read on the roll, he's so smart. That JB looks so dorky. Oh! No, the roll got caught! This shit should be enough to kill! Let's see, yeah, you have level two. That no! no! No spend! Oh no. 
Don't fumble now. All right, guard cancel comes out. Tries to go for the jump over. <laughs> Hits air to air. But still, just trying to play this chasing game. It's this cat and mouse game here. Leon Yo. Just, he's to find a straight hit. Anything will do it. Look at this building meter for that. Oh, the JCD. Oh, man. And in a close one, Leon Evan takes a 2-1. Round one. Ready? Go. All right, last first situation. Interesting, it's going to be Sylvie up against Kade L2. Sylvie's been gaining a lot of prominence. Uh, she has incredible meterless damage. She's got very strong fireballs. Uh, good pressure. Her only downside is, of course, just uh, very similar to uh, Hinako, is that she's stubby, right? Yeah. They've got some stubby normals, but... When they hit, they hit. Yeah. God damn. <laughs> he has some really great special moves. Really to make up for it. That DP is definitely one of them. Look at the range on it. Her pressure is also some of the most varied in the game. She's kind of like up there with Kukri with how much she can change up her pressure to make herself plus minus or just create gaps. Really creative. And she has a command grab because why not? Yeah, but if you're gonna be whipping DPs like that, you're gonna fall prey to Shadow X. Shelby is putting in work. Okay. <laughs> Both players are on one right now. You show me yours, I'll show you mine. Yeah, exactly. Man's had no fear. That's Daredevil right there. Yeah. All right, now Whip is coming in. One and a half bars on deck. <laughs> Hit <-pop. laughs> yeah, just pick up hard knockdown there after the DP. Nice. In the corner pressure going. Oh! It almost worked. It was almost a stroke of genius. I like the patience that we're seeing for Shadow X2. Clean jump in. That's what we were waiting for. Not gonna be able to kill off this. Don't have the meter. Oh. Nice. The jump back, JA. So far, Shadow X looking really good. Already right down to Isla here. Oh, that's gonna be a lot of damage. I get it. I totally respect spending the level two. You want to make sure that you can just get this character off the screen because you still have to go through two more, right? This is gonna be a long set ahead for Leon Evan. Two more characters to go through, and only one bar, and you already do it. Oh. Oh, that was almost the read of the century. A death like driver, but it didn't come out. JA. I, I maybe maybe it's a little too uh, maybe it's a little too much to say cookie, but I kind of feel like Clark's JA is one of the best jump ins in the game. Oh, absolutely, the godlike jump in. <laughs> it sets it up for everything he wants. Look at that landing there. It's a complete mix up. Is he gonna go for the overhead, the low, the command grab? You never know. And Shadow X is gonna take game number one. Good stuff, making that one a quick 1-0. The question is, do we get a swap from Lee and Evan here? Bro, with with Clark the way he yep. is and going unscathed in that recent patch, and with Tekken 8 coming out and King having some crazy stuff and bros being buffed in that game, it's a good time to be a grappler fan right now. <laughs> so true. King's kind of nutty in Tekken 8, I'm not going to lie. I can't wait to can't wait to see how that character pans out. I haven't watched a whole lot of Tekken 8 yet, but I'm curious. Wasn't there a a, a, a king in the Frosty's Grand Finals? Uh, yes, yes there was. Ooh. But uh, King, king currently has a bug. I, I know KOF's on the screen right now, but he currently has a bug where his uh, his armored move, if he's inputting the follow up. Uh, and even if he whiffs it, he keep, he retains the armor on his whiff recovery. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> and then he can just hop kick you. Yeah, King one Frosty. That's right. That's right. Select order. Thank you, Chad. 
I mean, I wasn't, I wasn't watching. I was, I, I was at uni. I looked up at the screen and people were screaming, and I was like, "Oh, there's King." The I Vanessa. Was I was on a plane. Ooh, Vanessa. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I stayed. I stayed that Sunday. Sadly. Clearly, I shouldn't have, cause I, I came out with a cough. Let's see. Vanessa. Right now, you're here watching some cough. Yeah, it's true. I'm coughing some cough. Round one. All right, Angel versus Clark. Yeah, where we it's time to wrestle. Switched out a lot of characters. Bring back Angel. Got out the Vanessa. Vanessa. And they Clark on point. Yeah, good old-fashioned wrestling match here. Up against the ropes. Gets hit with the backbreaker. Nice roll back. Get me out of there. Oh, Ooh, beautiful catch. That does put you at full screen after landing that grab. J.A. Yeah. hits it Clark. Oh my god, what? I felt like that was not intentional, but it ended up working out anyways. Yep, close C right on the dome. Shadow X with the early lead here and should get full health back. No, not quite. That round went on a, a little bit too long. Give her shoes back. Why is she wearing sandals? Boxer and sandals? Bro. Yeah. For the jury fans, you know. Here we go. <laughs> Backing up a little bit. Gets hit by the 2D. Runs right into the big boot. Oh, I like that. Okay, gets yourself the knockdown. Uh-huh. Blazer, Blazer wrong for that one. Oh, oh coming in to make sure that Leon Von can't finish the story. Nice, command dash back. Good stuff. Vanessa putting in work, taking out the Clark. Clark finally down. Now it's time for K-Dash to come on in. Three bars though on K-Dash's side. Just goes for the full on jump in round start. What's he gonna do? He's not scared. Nice jab. What the? I like the movement that we're seeing here. A lot of running in and swaying, trying to force those whips. Okay, it works again. Nice. No, that whip though. Lee and Evan had it all going. Oh, it's just like this. Everything could fall apart. Nice the key jump jump over. And there you go. Goodbye, Vanessa. She put up a valiant effort there, but it wasn't enough to take down Shadow X's K-Dash. Bye, Vanessa. A good try. Did get end up getting a bunch of health, and now it's down to the whip again. And we've seen what this whip can do. And that's dead K dash. Should be. There we go. Bro, that 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 freeze frame hit me like 3D. I can, I can touch the whip. It's like a 4D cinema. All right, anchor battle. Again, this is such a key round for the Ombong. Nice. Putting it off strong. But again, the problem here is that four and a half bars on Yori means that all this effort no! is about to be gone. Look at that. Bro, you got going. hit by the one starter you should not have gotten hit by. Imagine if he could loop. Uh, if he had four bars, if he could do level two into level two. <laughs> God. I mean, technically, he can. Yeah, he can. I wonder how much damage that does. Probably scales a lot. Yeah, it's also, like, pretty hard. It's, like, not, not tournament viable, but it is possible. Oh! oh! That was it. That was your opportunity, but missed it. Still, tries to go for the cross-up. Gark hits a forward. You can't block anything. Go the DP from deep. You're so smart. Wow, tying it up one apiece. What a stellar fight. These two know how to rumble. Winner. That was so scary.
down to the wire there. Able, able to prevent the 2-0 lead. Just like this, we have a competitive set. There we go. Both of them mashing on the rematch. Who would have thought making this change to on hell uh, would have been such a big deal? Yo, the Vanessa was cooking. Yeah, bro. Vanessa, on hell and Vanessa. But now we have to see. I mean, on hell, unfortunately, did not do a whole lot. So if she can kind of carry more weight in this first match against Clark, I think that's going to spell really well for their chances. Oh! Nice, 2D. Again. Yo, they are just trading. Alright, 2D with this mark. I like the checks with the 2D there. Nice jump out. Got it that time. Oh, I love the JB. JB, a really underutilized tool. Blows up. The advanced strike does not exist. And that's going to be it for the on hell. Clark making quick work of it. Now, this is where it really shined last time the Vanessa. Get a calculator and fix yourself with the $2 donation. What a Thank name. So oh, uh -oh no. the low into the EX. Ooh. Yo! Nice. Second time you're, charm. You're just better. <laughs> yeah, she gets like full corner carry off of this. <laughs> pressure, the sways, my god. <laughs> the in no, the out. Width. Oh, Shadow Strike is getting up blown up this time. Drops her right on her dome. Yeah, the that's the second time that Leon Evan has tried to do uh, some move out of that kind of uh, Oki scramble situation. And now the Clark going up against the Whip with still two characters sitting behind him. Jump in, JA putting in his work. Fades out the reversal. Uh oh, bro. Clark is Clarking right now, Cookie. Yeah, it is time. It's time to play the video game. Nice patience. Last time he got hit by that. Woo! Ends up working out okay. That's gonna push to the corners. Oh, the jump back. So smart. Yeah. Tried to go for that Frankensteiner. There we go, DP hits its mark, and the cross-up connects. No OCB for you, but still, this is this is quite a mountain to climb right now. Doesn't even have two bars, has to go through two characters. Oh, that almost could have felt the end right there. Nice. Reverses. With a sweep for the punish. Still, it's like you can't make a mistake, right? You have to play this neutral perfectly. Yeah. And no! There and there it is. The DP, the one time it doesn't work. And that's going to be 2-1 right now for Shadow X. Just needs one more to get that run back against Dark Angel. And remember... When they played each other also, it was a 3-0 wash, to be honest. <laughs> Maybe that's what we need in these trying times. <laughs> Just be washed. Oh, going back to member select. Hitting the drawing board one more time. I'm curious what it's going to be. Oh, we brought out the Blue Mary and the Isla again. Mm, okay, to, okay. to be honest, I thought the Vanessa was doing pretty well. I thought so too. Thought the Vanessa was actually cooking, but I guess not. And put the whip in the secondary Isla on the anchor.
All right, let's see how it goes in this potential final game of Losers Finals. Let's see if these character changes all make it worthwhile. Round one. Ready? Go! Oh. No, two trade on either side. No, wanted the cross up Frankensteiner, didn't get it. Oh, tries to go for the neutral jump there. Oh, clean J A punish again. You see Leoma going for those 2Ds, right? The sweeps. And the sweeps, while they are great pokes, they're ended up being the death of them. Yeah. And be whiffing though, especially because Clark is going to really try to hop JA when he's out of specific ranges as much as possible. Like, specifically the ranges where 2D is really strong. Nice. Finds a way in with the spider. Nice read on the roll. Enough to kill. Hey, breaking the leg. All right, K Dash coming in. 300 health on the Mary. Oh no! Another leg breaker. Nice jump. Okay. Yo, the immediate oh, are, EX fighter. We are connecting. Finally, a DP comes out. Shutting down a little bit of that momentum. Oh, those, those 2Ds have been connecting like crazy too. You no, know, the high risk, high reward, right? Still, you gotta be careful about whipping anything at this stage. There we go. Blows right on in with the minute spike. Not gonna get full health back on the K Dash, but he still does have a lot of meter, which is really important. Yeah, I could easily just change the flow of this matchup, right? Play it more, the pendulum into his favor. Four bars, bro. God help you if you get hit. Yeah, exactly. Especially from a good starter. Try to go for that sweep. Nice. Yeah, jumping in is going to be really risky against Whip. Oh! oh. No! We lost it! Not a Wait. No, no, no. Not enough to kill. Get the love pass. Okay, you're cracked. No shot at switch sides, too. That's crazy. Yes. He's just better. Big unfortunate. Goes for the guard cancel. Shower strike whiffs. Goodbye, K Dash. Yo, Leon Evan potentially going to a game five. We're fighting our heart and soul out here right now against Shadow X. We to fight our heart and soul to, to find out who gets 3 0'd by Dark Angel. <laughs> That's crazy. Listen, bro. If Shadow X can't do it, I don't know if Leon ever really stands a chance. I'm sniffing some favoritism. Yeah. By his commentary. It's true. Listen, bro. You see how badly he cooked Shadow X? I did see. I did that's, see. That, that was saucy kill. All right. Even game. I'm actually curious. I'm about to go do a little bit of research. Final round. Ready? Go. Need a hand. Oh. All right, here we go. Trying to jump off the wall there. Nice block. Nice right, for the jump in. Just gets the close no. seat, bro. He wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. Yeah, the spaghetti is spilling right now. That was your huge opportunity here. I like going for the guard cancel to try and restart the reset the situation. Keep the corner pressure. It's really important. Nice jump back, JD's been using that a lot. Crazy. Yeah, you have to hold on to that meter. Okay. Yeah, I mean, he built the third bar off of that. That is true. He was able to. Maybe Quick he's just confirmed. a genius. Try to go for the taco. He just needs anything. Scum Gale, anything will work. He also, he just needs a little bit of, okay. Anything kills. He's there a jump back. AD defense. Shadow X taking a 3-1 over Lee and Evan in losers finals. So to make the run back in the grand. Don't go anywhere because this grand finals is about to be insane. 
right. in, and I quote, nice. Oh! He jumped 2C punish on the fireball recovery. Yo, boy. That was defense. Oh, he had the lead, too. Maybe this Isla character is cheap. Just a little bit. Just a little. Uh, just a little. Might go for the backflip there. Isla has that unique air movement, right? That is not really normal for KOF characters. Uh, it's something that can separate her from a lot of the rest of the cast. Yeah. Shune has that too. But hers is more vert vertical, while hers is horizontal. That's kind of the big difference between them. Yeah. Ah, the taco almost works. Shadow X in the lead right now. All it takes is one in the JA. First round, Shadow X. Hit her with the boy. Hit the boy. All right, the the mastermind himself, the Shunie coming out, the the anime air dasher that has been cooking people all day. See though, because Clark is kind of cooking at the moment. Already starting off hyper aggressive too. The micro walk into the two B to catch him. He might just be better. He might be him. Oh, he might be him. Okay, what's the mix? Nice low. That, that's enough to kill. Wow, the optimization. Is this fight already over? Yo, Shadow X? This is the man who got 3 0 Yo, Shadow X? Hold up. Maybe he wanted to come from Loser's Run. Maybe he wanted more games. Maybe Dark Angel ducks him in Netflix. So he wanted more games in tournaments. So the first set, that was data, all right? Yeah, exactly. Uh-oh, but hold on now. Benny Maru has plenty of butter and is ready to start cooking. About to be sitting on five bars. Oh. Nice. Oh, that's so big. Yeah, going for the option to... Immediately out. Okay. I, I like that we were keeping Benny Maru in the corner too, right? Not going for the EX tackle into uh, elbow drop for the Oki. We just wanted to hold him in that corner to keep the pressure up. But really good response from Dark Angel with the DP. Yeah. But half health on this Benny Maru. Is it enough to get through these two characters? That's a great start. Ooh, that's, that's a combo. Yeah, three frames. Oh, no. Huge whip there for Shadow X, though. Yo, he is blowing up right now. What? Ah! Oh, the back roll to call out the minute spike. That would have called out minute spike or DP. He's an atheist. Bro, not like this. If he loses like this, that's crazy. He might be mine, bro. He might be. Might be not I'd win and explode. <laughs> not the not I'd win, bro. <laughs> and we can't even explain that. I know. There's just anime onlys in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so funny every time. Someone made a sticker out of it. That's fire. Put that on my stick. Uh uh uh. Oh my god, no way. Bro, this is not good right now. Even one bar here for Dark Angel, he just has to find that hit. Don't get reverse sweat by the Benny. The anti air, you're a genius. He just threw it out. Reckless abandon gets the jump. The reverse OCB with Benny Maru. He's just better. He's just him. He's the honored one, bro. He's the honored one. I'm on the earth and the heavens. Oh my god. <laughs> that is unreal. That is a devastating way to start off grand finals when you're in the loser side. Oh, that devastating. Insane. He did that. He came all the way back, still not dropping a single game. I really thought Clark was going to have that OCB. Oh, no. We were wrong. Very, very wrong. And now Isla is the one getting the first blood here. Dark Angel's looking all warmed up. I wonder if Shadow X is a little tilted from that. Three Frankensteiners all baited out. Not like this. The crumbling happening in real time. Yeah, this 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 smells like 
like a little bit of tilting from that. That is, that is emotional damage is absolutely correct, chat. Well, let's see. We have to weather. We have to steal ourselves. Steal our mind. Caleb Demet will go away. There we go. K-Dash picking up the pace here. You have to get the ball back in your court. Yeah, he sort of took it right back. He's taking it back. He's ready to slam dunk. Yeah, really? Oh, no. He went from a Clark OCB to a potential Eastlo OCB. And there How we go. Dark Hop Angel's playing right now. Okay, we're out of there. All right, level one. Should be enough. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> but with 30 seconds on the clock, we're just going to get out of orange health, I believe. Yep. yep. All right. All right. Now he's low Much more manageable. Never mind. Oh, you're actually dead, huh? Yeah, yep. Meter All efficient, too. Run. Very meter efficient. Able to... Do it without utilizing one full bar there. Very nice. Yeah, very smart. Very good stuff from Dark Angel. One character away. Bro. How do you just land into super like that? That was a cross under two. You might just be the goat. You hit him with the cross cut super. Blocking all the tacos too. Finally gets caught. There's the fireworks. Nice. Pressed immediately. Oh my goodness. How do you block that? How do you block it? The offense doesn't stop. All right. You have one more guess. Oh, okay. just gets booted in the skull at Dark Angel. At two. Oh. Cookie. This might be, is Dark uh, Angel going to close this out without losing a single game tonight? You know, I would not put it past them. And also, for the first Saturday KOF, he is doing it in pure Dark Angel fashion. I mean, this man is, this man is the angel of death, all right? <laughs> Here to claim souls. And this could be the very last Level match one. of the tournament here. Shadow X needs to dig deep and find something. Oh, he's finding uh, himself in a corner right now. Jesus. What is happening? Okay. Yeah, finally. finally, he blocked one of those. That was so much damage. Wow. Oh, oh, it ends up working out. Shadow X fighting back. He's not down and out quite yet. Where there's a will, there's a way, Cookie. This should be it. Okay, yep, okay, there okay. it is. Into the DDT. Very nice. All right, the Isla did not run like it did before, but now the Shunie is out to play. Let's see if Clark's going to be able to shut this down. Nice. Jumping on in, harassing with that close B. Okay, Shadow X awake. Getting the right reads. JA is so good. Recognizing the counter hit there and able to get the DX tackle. Brother. Nice! Yo, that's Footsie. Footsie's in has the corner pressure now. But look at this. Even with the corner pressure, Dark Angel is not afraid to push Bun. Immediately blows his way out of the corner, forcefully taking Clark down with him. It. This is where the shooting A starts to come in. Three bars, half health. All it takes is one hit, one knockdown. Shadow X, weather the storm is the question. Nice block. No, the immediate low. Oh my god, it doesn't matter. You made him whiff and he still knew. Brother. JB, okay. Rushing in with those lows. Look at the way that he's fuzzy guarded too. 
does get caught and now here we go benny maru last time we saw this character he ran a train on shadow x with the reverse ocv yeah this is the last wall that stands the great wall of that haircut oh no and the wall starts to close in no, he knew it was coming! How did he know? Bro, this is... This is Benny Maru's unstoppable. He just knew! How did he know the DP was gonna come immediately? His his Rinnegan is open, bro. He's got the Mangekyu Sharingan. Yeah. Okay. The start. Oh! That's so much damage you can kill! Yeah, this absolutely is gonna be dead. You can kill! Yes! We've done it! The first game Dark Angel has lost in this bracket. All eyes are on the winner. He can bleed. We've done it. That is one game, but now he needs to win the next two straight. That's going to be rough. It's going to be rough, but if anyone can do it, Shadow X definitely can. He's got to rise from the darkness and ascend. Oh. You got Dark Angel versus Shadow X. Both players molded in darkness. Ready? It's like that pit in the Arkham series. It's like Batman versus Bane here. Yeah, exactly. But is Shadow X going to get his back broken? There you go. He's definitely getting his back broken right now. Oh no, the whiff. Is that enough to kill? Oh my god. All right, that's one character down for Shadow X. And full health on Isla. Nice. Oh, no. Ooh, look at the pressure, bro. It does not stop. Backdash still gonna get cost. The, the, it looked like the recovery got caught by the DP. But speaking of recovery, oh no! Huge whiff. That's not gonna be enough to kill. Close though. Oh my God! He bet it all. He sends it, bro. This is it. Last opportunity. Iori. It's all on his shoulders. Has to make uh, almost a perfect reverse OCV. Oh no, got mashed on. The Isla begins to close in. The potential OCV to end the set. The Isla's closing in. The walls are closing in. Gets the plus frames on the advanced strike. Yo, he's the roll. Oh no, the DB came out. Only one spend. What? You kill this character. We're trying to save our... our oh, the immediate oh, neutral no. jump. That's it. That's got to be it, right? Follow up. Be it. Oh my goodness. The 3-1 from Dark Angel closing it out with an Isla OCV. And a poetic way to end it. The very first TNS where advancing strike is a mechanic. Someone loses by trying to go for advancing strike.